Welcome back, everybody. Visual Medication Gaming. Part 2, Episode 2. Let's go. See anything? She better see something. How crazy damn week. How crazy we'll find some shelter. Is Clementine There's the scout? A lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. If I had to Beck. But we're almost out of food. We gotta save it. We need to keep his strength up, baby. I'll talk later. I want to let the uh, game do its thing. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. So looking around here, uh, they got Clem doing. <laughs> they got Clem doing reconnaissance with a newly found group. Um. She's already one of the most valuable members of this group, and she just joined it. And she's a a kid. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across slow and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. Wow. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? Oh, they're fighting She's over... little girl, Luke. No, She's they're fighting... little girl. I mean, yep. hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. He's got a point. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. Let's I can go. go, too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Yes. Let's go, Luke. Take charge. You're the hey, leader. You uh, should be. Sorry about that. I just I could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? Seems like we're already in the middle of it. Tell me about it. Hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. Mm. Let's go. I'm telling you. She was raised by I'll Lee. Take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. I've got the big one. Hey, kid. Look, it's not like I don't know you have guts, but are you crazy? No. Maybe I am. Maybe. Just stick with the plan, okay? A little bit. A little bit is okay. A little bit's good for you. Just out of control. Oh. 
Go ahead. Give it a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. You go ahead and tell him, Sam. You've done this before. Nice work, kid. Ow. This kid. She's messing with him. Shouldn't be a time to panic. They should have this. Yep. That's not good. I'm okay. I'm stuck. I can't reach. It's okay. Clem, look, we'll figure something out. Behind you. That scared me. I was worried about Luke more than Clementine. Dude, look at her. Let's keep going. Like Lee, you know? She reminds me of Lee. You see him? Yeah. All right, <clears throat> we know people are dangerous. And you do the talking. What? Yep. Why me? No, I perfect. Fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. We don't know. Don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. You know, on second thought, maybe I should do the talking. What should I say? I don't know. Ask him for directions. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. I'm not an asshole. 
What, you calling me an asshole? <laughs> you folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Uh, yeah. I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's, uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Dick! No! Stop! <laughs> wow. Is so Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang so out from mine. sad. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. All the things that happen on this game. Like, you can't stop other people from not having better judgment. Like, they should have better judgment, but they don't. They're irrational, what emotional, was that? What's that back there? instinctive. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. It's not what bad. I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Shut up, Nick. What did you see, Clem? Yeah. That guy gonna shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. He wasn't gonna do anything. I know what I saw. Shut up, Nick. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You Shut up, Nick. Carver? I don't know. I No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Luke, can I talk to you alone? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Bex dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. You could use a little downsizing. Sure. Thanks, Clem. Thanks a lot for backing me up there. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Luke, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He seemed nice. Damn. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? Damn. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. That's all I had left of him. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. Alright, so, uh, Nick shot, uh, the very cool guy. 
I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. Oh, that was really messed up. The man said he had lots of food. There's got to be something left. Everybody. So paranoid. Oh. Feels pretty good. You can just look at Clementine's eyes and you can like tell like she's re she's ready. All the bad stuff she's been through as horrific as it was. It's kind of prepared her to become who she is. It's dead. I guess he slept here. Yeah. It says a lot when the adults are <laughs> are looking to Clementine. Like, what do you think? Man, I thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. I'm just saying. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? Lots of people. It happens all the time now. It's fucking crazy. Pardon my French. That's funny. She looks just like you. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. Rebecca um, can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. I know you are. I would be too. The hell is that? Walkers. We got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. <laughs> You know, I wish we could find Krista. I would like to know what happened to her. I heard a gunshot when Clem got separated from well, her, so she could be dead. What are we but... waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My wow. back is done being careful. What a pregnant woman. Doesn't look like anybody's home. You'll need a horse or a stretcher. Damn. Nailed down tight. She's got to take breaks. I'll check around front. Our I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Could probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. Yeah, just a, a really tall treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I hated it. Oh. Yeah, she had to hide out from zombies while her parents were away. Uh, so that's why she doesn't like her treehouse. But it probably would have been really cool Just if she did Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Well, that Let's sounds go. stupid. Or on yeah. trains. <laughs> Yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. Whoa. Oh, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. All right, just, just slow down. Just for a second, okay? 
Got your grip? You just told me not to look. Good point. Made it. Ah. You see anything? Too small to be a raven. Must have been a crow. I can see the bridge. Oh, there's flashlights. Wait, I see something. What is yep. it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put Damn. the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's go, clown. Please, just do what he says. <gasps> no way. Kenny. Wait, you know this guy? Oh my oh gosh. God. Easy choice. That's I'll take cold. that as a yes. Awesome. These people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you You're sure welcome. You don't mind? It's You're gonna welcome. storm soon. Please come in. Clementine says you're welcome. Are you kidding me? That's great. Amazing. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. <laughs> yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. No. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? Absolutely, bro. If you tell me they're good, then I'm good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. We're cool, okay? Hey, hey, we're cool. We're cool. Clementine? Everyone, calm down. Yeah, I gotta worry about that guy. He just shot a dude Dad, in the bridge. Look, a Christmas tree. Well, now, Sarah. <laughs> Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. Oh, this is great. We got Christmas music. Kenny's alive! It's crazy. It's so awesome. That's so awesome. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. Kenny is so happy to see Clown. Look at his face.
Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. He sure did. Hell. He was a hell of a guy. Yep. When my son... Well, he took care of him. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? After Lee, I was alone. I found Krista and Omid, but it didn't last. They're both gone now. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. But everything's gonna be fine now. Tell you the truth, I should have never made it out of Savannah. For some reason, I tried to save that fucking shitbird, Ben. Then it turned into a damn cluster. Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita, thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? And on that note, helping Walt with dinner will be a great time to end Clementine? this part. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. We're old friends. I will see you guys for the I next met part. Him after it happened. Next when time. He was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Thanks everybody for watching.